Renaissance Florence on Five Florence a Day by Charles Fitzroy builds itself as a fact-packed guide providing all the practical advice you need for a journey back in time to late 15th century Florence. Several recent books have come out with this theme of being a travel guide back into history, and you certainly get good coverage of the famous Renaissance city. Quite a lot gets mentioned here, including all the must-see sites in Florence, such as the Piazza della Signora and a cathedral and other churches. This is perhaps the best part of the book, giving you a couple of pages each on these ma famous medieval sites, which conveniently enough are still around today. The book also delivers many aspects of daily life in the city, covering topics such as dealing with money, where to get medicine, and what are the best festivals during the year. You also get brief descriptions of some of the more famous residents of Florence, including Lorenzo di Medici, Leonardo da Vinci, the artist Sandro Botticelli, as well as the notorious preacher Savonarola and the aristocratic lady Ginevra di Benci. The book ends like a typical travel guide by quickly describing some of the places close to Florence, starting with the nearby village of Fiesole, before going on to other neighborhoods, neighbors such as Siena and Pisa. For, for what the book sets out to do, it does it very well, giving the reader a fun and interesting view of Florence and its people. The 150 pages are filled with short little stories and notes, along with many drawings and pictures. There are several color images too, along with a modern map of this city's historic center. If you plan on going to Florence, definitely consider taking this little guide with you in order to get a, a feel of how the city must have been like over 500 years ago.